boy, boy, boy. What did I tell y'all? What did I tell y'all? Listen, y'all. Listen. This fight is a good fight between two young, young, hungry competitors. But there was only going to be room for one winner. And I knew who that winner was going to be. You know, this fight, it turned out kind of how I thought it would turn out. I knew who would win, but I just didn't think the person who won this fight would win the way she did. Okay? I knew she was going to win, but I did not think she would win how she did. Okay. This fight with Miranda Maverick, okay? And Liana Jojoa. Uh, Maverick showcased some striking. Now, look, y'all. Look. This is no salt on Miranda Maverick, okay? You can definitely tell that she's definitely better. But, I mean, okay. You can showcase your striking against Liana Jojoa. You can, okay? That's not a strong point. Jojoa is not like an accomplished striker. That's not where she's strong yet. Jojoa is strong on the ground, okay? So, yeah, Maverick, she's going to look good. She's going to look very good striking against Liana Jojoa, okay? Um, but this is where Maverick is in her career, okay? This was a perfectly, perfectly matched fight, okay? Because Maverick, I kind of like the route that she's going. I like how, they, I like how they're actually pushing Maverick through. They're not just, they're not setting up for failure. I think Maverick is set up to win, you know, and I'm talking about rent, win the right way. Um, Maverick definitely, you know, had a definite selection of strikes, and I was I was very pleased at watching what she was doing. I was pleased. Um, Jojoa in the early of the fight was catching Maverick with this right hand, and I said, oh, okay, Maverick done got hit with that right hand about four times. Is she going to make an adjustment? And, you know, in young fighters, y'all, you don't, they don't make adjustments that well. But I saw Maverick make an adjustment. And what she did to stop the right hand from coming over top, Miranda Maverick started throwing a body kick. And people, you know, you see that body kick, she was slipping it in there. And you can tell that uh, Jojoa, she could not, she was hating that body kick, man. But Jojoa stopped throwing that damn right hand. She stopped. Every time Maverick hit her with that body shot, the right hand slowed down. And that's, that's really a good adjustment that I'm seeing in a young fighter such as Miranda Maverick. Um... And I didn't think she would be able to do that, but she did it. Then, you know, her combinations, Maverick was ending her combinations off with an elbow. And I'm going to tell you, man, them elbows was nasty. And she was catching Jojo Wild with these elbows. And I'm talking about Jojo Wild ate them. But Liana Jojo Wild, she's not going to move her head. She's going to keep her head right there. And she's going to walk forward. That's her strategy. Jojo Wild don't have a striking strategy. It's just to come forward. I mean, I give Jojo Wild credit. I mean, she can cut the octagon off well, but she flat-footed, and she's very, very slow. And I knew that Maverick was going to have the speed advantage, okay? And I said that in my, my pre-fight breakdown, is that Miranda Maverick is going to have the speed advantage. She's going to be able to take the angles over, uh, over, over Jojo Wild. And that's exactly what Miranda Maverick did. She took the angles. I mean, she stopped uh, Liana Jojo Wild from throwing the right hand. And the only thing that Jojo Wild had was the right hand. That's it. She couldn't do anything else. I even thought Maverick... Um, I thought Maverick was going to try to mix it up and throw some uppercuts in there. But she didn't do that. Maverick, instead of throwing the uppercut, I like it how she faked the uppercut and then she threw the elbow. And that was, it was beautiful, guys. That was nice. Because Jojoa was looking for an uppercut. She thought the uppercut was coming. And then Maverick just, she hit that uppercut and then she threw the elbow right behind it, man. And I'm going to tell you, boy, it was nice. Because Jojoa, whole, her whole shit got, uh, PG-13, child, her whole face. Her whole nose was all jacked up. I mean, it was jacked up. And Maverick also took advantage of the fact that this girl is like, she's like a turtle. She's a mobile, she's an immobile target. Maverick towed them damn legs up. I'm talking about, kick out, pop, kick out, kick out, kick out, kick out. She would tear them legs up, y'all. And I'm going to tell you, man, Jojo started slowing down even more slower than what she already was. Um, so, you know, the end of the round happens. And Jojo, I had a no, I mean, a cut on her nose that I'm going to tell y'all something, man. I'm not going to say that the cut was, was, wasn't that bad, but I can tell you if there was a stitch Duran in the corner, he would have stopped the cut. You know, her team cost her, man. They cost her. Her cut man cost her this fight. And, you know, they couldn't stop that bleeding because when you look at the cut, it was a nasty cut, but I've seen worse cuts. And I've seen corner men actually stop the bleeding on worse cuts. Liana Jojo, while her corners sucked. I mean, they sucked. Your corners sucked. You couldn't stop the cut in one of the biggest fights of your career? 
in Jojo Wobble's game, she was ready to go back in. They couldn't stop the bleeding. I've seen, man, I've seen Floyd Mayweather when he got cut by Marcos Maidana. That cut was bad. And guess who stopped it? <laughs> guess who stopped it? Well, you know, rest in peace to uh, his old cut man. Okay? But his old cut man has stopped that cut. Stitch Duran could have stopped that cut. Okay? It's plenty of cut men in the business that can stop a cut. Okay? It's plenty of them. But, you know, I don't know, man. They put ice on it. And then they put like a cotton swab in it. And I'm sitting here like, what the hell is that going to do? What, what, what is that? No, 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 no. You got to get some of the stuff, the tools of the trade. A cotton swab and a little Vaseline, that's not stopping the cut. Okay, so, yeah. So, Jojo, I lost the fight based on the cut. Didn't get stopped. Like, seriously, well, she was already losing the fight anyway. But I'm saying, though, you know, she would have liked to have another round or two to go back out to see if she can make her adjustments, you know, get her game plan going. But, you know, now the referee, Lucas Bowaski. I tell you, I, I don't I don't like him. I'm going to tell you, him and I, we've had words on social media. We've had words on social media. This man don't like me, and I don't like him. But I tell you, I do agree with his decision to stop the fight. Would have cut that nasty, and if y'all can't stop the fight, stop it. Stop the fight, okay? Go ahead and let this fight go. Look, it's a done deal, okay? It is what it is, okay? Come back, you fight another day. You'll come back to fight another day. Jojo I got her ass whooped. Listen, y'all, she did. There's nothing we can say about this. We can't do nothing about it. Jojo I got the living possum piss beat out of her. I'm talking about, man, she was getting beat around that octagon. And the only thing she can do is walk forward. She kept trying to engage, walk forward. Man, Miranda Maverick lit her up. I'm talking about cacao. 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 Lit her up. Okay? Now, my one problem, and this is the problem in WMMA. Maverick did not call out her next opponent. Maverick, you got to do that. If you're looking for the opportunities that you want them to give you, you got to be a mouthpiece. You got to call out who you want next. I don't care who it is. Just call somebody out. That's the frustrating part when I watch the women fight. I like watching the women because they use a lot of skill set. They have to because... They don't have the, the true punching power or the knockout kicking power of the, of the males. They don't have that. Women are more technical. But these women, they, they just don't make the right call outs. Like, how are you going to be in this fight of this magnitude? You know, you're fighting for your life. And then you get out. It's a business now. You're not just a fighter in the fight game living out your dream. This is a business. You, you got to call out the next person. And, and I was really disappointed. That she didn't call somebody out. I don't know. Maybe call out Jillian Robinson. Jillian Robinson on a hot street. Like, you, you, could y'all imagine Maverick versus Robertson? That'd be a hell of a fight. Maverick versus Robertson would be a hell of a fight. Maverick versus Shevchenko would be a hell of a fight. I mean, there, there are some fights going on, guys, that, you know, she could have called out some people. Okay, or, you know, Roxanne Montefiore, what you doing next month? Okay, let me come and slap the Goku out of your head. Something. But no, it was nothing. Shout out to Miranda Maverick for the victory, though. Um, I'm glad she won. And this is somebody that the UFC definitely... And I told y'all, this is one of the fighters that they need to keep all the time. There are a lot of fighters, in my opinion, that need to go. I think Jojo deserves a stay. I think Maverick, Mazo, you know. Oh, Maverick versus Mazo. Now, that'll be a good fight. Oh, man. Can, can y'all see the 125-pound division now starting to shape up? You got Jessica Andrade making herself known. You got Miranda Maverick. You got Sabina Mazo coming off, you know, really doing the thing, knocking out Justine Kish. Then you got, uh, you know, you got the young talent Jojo Wild right here. Man, look, we got some young, hungry fighters in the 125-pound division. Let's get, hey, let's get Jojo Calderwood all the way the hell out of here. Let's get Roxanne Monteferry all the way the hell out of here. Let, 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 let's get uh, Lauren Murphy all the way the hell out of here. Let's get Jessica I all the way the hell out of here. Shout out to these young, these young fighters, man. Shout out to these young fighters. Man, these girls, they going in here, they getting it. And these are entertaining fights, man. They ain't sitting here, you know, flapping off at the mouth. <laughs> no, they're getting in here and they're getting it done. Shout out. I'm done.